Minasan konnichiwa Yuka des. Hi everyone, this is Yuka. In today's video, we will review new grammar patterns introduced in lesson 45 of the Minano Nihongo textbook. Without further ado, let's get started. Here are the grammar points that we will discuss today. First, by wa and second, the pattern noni. First topic, bai, or sometimes pronounced bawai. The noun bai means case, situation, or time. When used as a conjunction, it expresses a hypothetical situation. It translates to in case of, if, or when. A similar grammar is the pattern toki. Both are used to mean when in hypothetical condition. Thus, they are at times interchangeable. However, toki specifies a time condition while bai indicates a situation. It should be noted as well that by cannot be used for past and personal events. It usually talks about a possibility that does not happen very often and is unfavorable. Example, earthquake, fire, accidents, inconveniences, etc. So sentences with by often indicate the necessary response to cope when such situation occurs. The basic structure is verb in plain ta or nai form, e adjective, na adjective na, noun no, plus the pattern baiwa. Example, Kaji no bai, in case of fire. Let's review some examples from the book. Kotsu jiko ni atta bai wa sugu hyaku toba ni renraku shite kudasai. Kotsu jiko ni atta bai wa sugu hyaku. Kutoba ni renraku shite kudasai. In case you encounter a traffic accident, please call 110 immediately. Note, just like toki, the ta form in front of bai indicates that the event should happen first before the action in the main clause can take place. Example, Nihon e iku toki kamera o kaimashita. I bought a camera when I went to Japan. The action happens before arriving in Japan or on the way to Japan. Nihon e itta toki kamera o kaimashita. I bought a camera when I went to Japan. The action happens after arriving in Japan. So changing the tense in example 1 to au would mean before a traffic accident. Nanika mondai ga atta bai wa watashi ni itte kudasai. Nanika mondai ga atta Tabai wa watashi ni itte kudasai. If you encounter any problem, please tell me. Again, the past tense form is used since by sentences talk about what to do should something happen. Uketsuke ni dare mo inai bai wa Kono botan o oshite kudasai. 
If no one is at the reception, please press this button. What should I do if I don't have a receipt? Kaze ga tsuyoui bai wa mado wo akinai de kudasai. Kaze ga tsuyoui bai wa mado wo akinai de kudasai. Do not open the window if the wind is strong. Ea ko no choshi ga warui bai wa sugu renraku shite kudasai. Ea ko no choshi ga warui bai wa sugu renraku shite kudasai. If the air conditioner is not working properly, please contact us immediately. Kusuri ga hitsuyo na bai wa Uketsuke ni kite kudasai. Kusuri ga hitsuyo na bai wa uketsuke ni kite kudasai. Please come to the counter if you need medicine. Tomodachi o tsurete kuru bai wa shirasite kudasai. Tomodachi o tsurete kuru bai wa Shirasite kudasai. If you will bring a friend, please let us know. Kaisho o yasumu bai wa doshitara i desu ka? Kaisho o yasumu bai wa doshitara i desu ka? What should I do if I will be absent from the office? Shoku doga yasumi no bai wa soto de tabite kudasai. Shoku doga yasumi no bai wa soto de tabite kudasai. If the cafeteria is closed, please eat outside. Nijukiro ijo no bai wa どうしたらいいですか? What should I do if it is more than 20 kilograms? Second topic, the grammar noni. Aside from stating a purpose, another use of the conjunctive noni is to link contradicting clauses. It corresponds to the English although, even though, and in spite of inconcessive constructions. Noni functions similarly to keredomo and ga in the sense that all can be used to link two clauses that are opposed in meaning. However, the distinction of the noni sentence is that it implies a stronger sense of reversal or contrast and oftentimes reflects speakers' emotions such as surprise, disappointment, frustration, etc. The basic structure is Verb in plain form E adjective, na adjective, na, noun, na, plus the grammar, noni. Note, with na adjectives and nouns, the copula da is changed to na. The difference between noni and keredomo or ga. For noni, 
the main clause states a factual event. There is a strong contrast between the result and the expectation. It expresses the speaker's various sentiments such as surprise, frustration, and complaints. It expresses contrast subjectively. Queredomo or ga may be used when the main clause does not state a factual event. It expresses simple contrast can be used with requests, suggestions, etc. It expresses contrast objectively. Kari wa nihonji na no ni kanji ga kakemasen. He is Japanese but he can't write kanji. Kari wa nihonji desu ga kanji ga kakemasen. He is Japanese but he can't write kanji. Kari wa nihonjin da keredomo kanji ga kakemasen. He is Japanese but he can't write kanji. Sentence 1 expresses the feeling of surprise or disbelief. The main clause is contrary to the general expectation that if one is Japanese, one will be able to write kanji. Sentences 2 and 3 do not express a feeling of surprise or disbelief. Both simply state a fact. Let's review some examples from the book. Nijikan naranda no ni chiketto ga even though I line up for two hours, I couldn't buy a ticket. Kare wa nihon e kita koto ga nai no ni nihongo ga jōzu desu. Kare wa nihon e kita koto ga nai no ni nihongo ga jōzu desu. He is good at Japanese even though he has never been to Japan. Tanoshi mi ni shite ita no ni ryoko ga chushi ni natte shimaimashita. Tanoshi mi ni shite ita no ni ryoko ga chushi ni natte shimaimashita. I was looking forward to the trip but it was cancelled. Shigoto wa isogashi no ni kyuryo wa yasui desu. Shigoto wa isogashi no ni Kyuryo wa yasui desu. The salary is low despite the busy work. O shogatsu na no ni shigoto o shinakereba narimasen. O shogatsu na no ni shigoto o shinakereba narimasen. Even though it's New Year, I have to work. Hoken shou ga hitsuyou datta no ni motte kuru no wo wasuremashita. Hoken shou ga hitsuyou datta no ni motte kuru no wo wasuremashita. I forgot to bring the insurance card despite the fact that it was necessary. Kono apato wa kitanakote semai no ni yachin wa takai desu. Kono apato wa kitanakote semai no ni yachin wa takai desu.
Even though this apartment is dirty and small, the rent is expensive. どうしたんですかどうしたんですか What happened? やこそこは十時なのに、彼女がまだ来ないんです。やこそこは十時なのに、彼女がまだ来ないんです。The appointment is ten o'clock, but she hasn't come yet. このお寺は静かですね。このお寺は静かですね。This temple is quiet, isn't it? ええ、そうですね。町の真中にあるのに。ええ、そうですね。町の真中にあるのに。Yes, I agree, even though it's in the middle of the town. A n o n i clause may also be used independently when the conclusion is quite obvious or implied. ミーラーさんは遅いですね。ミーラーさんは遅いですね。Mr. Miller is late. ええ、そうですね。一度も遅れたことがないのに。ええ、そうですね。一度も遅れたことがないのに。Yes, I agree, even though he's never been late. Another grammar pattern that is used to indicate contrast is the temo construction. It translates to even if. Example, ashita ame ga futte mo sakka o shimasu. We are going to play soccer tomorrow, even if it rains. Unlike noni, which expresses established facts or real situations, temo expresses future and hypothetical conditions or imaginary situations. Even if I become a millionaire, I will live a simple life. Even though he is a millionaire, he lives a simple life. And that concludes our lesson for today. See you in the next one!